Rhinoplasty, more commonly known as the nose job, is an operation that involves changing the shape of the nose to improve its cosmetic appearance. In some cases, they may also be a functional problem with the difficulty in breathing through the nose. This is something that can also be corrected as a part of the procedure. If you are thinking about a rhinoplasty and unhappy with the shape of your nose, then the consultation with your surgeon is the most important part of the process. In this appointment, or more importantly series of appointments, the surgeon should find out exactly what are your particular concerns with your nose and explain to you what can be done surgically to meet your expectations. It is routine practice for us to take some medical photographs of your face in order to plan the procedure and also to explain to you what we're going to be doing. Rhinoplasty is carried out under a general anaesthetic as a day case procedure so you shouldn't need to stay in hospital overnight. There are two parts to the nose, there is an upper bony part and a lower cartilage part. The upper bony part forms the bridge of the nose and the lower cartilage part includes the tip of your nose. As a part of the procedure, cuts are made inside and sometimes outside your nose and the skin and soft tissue is lifted off the bone and cartilage of the nose. This gives us access to the framework of the nose so that we can change the size, shape and overall general appearance of the nose. After rhinoplasty, you should really allow for about one to two weeks off work. There will often be a dressing or a splint applied to the bridge of your nose to protect your nose and allow it to heal correctly. We often remove this splint or dressing about a week following surgery.